Hello everyone, I'm Braden and I'm a core developer here at Skysif. I'm here to introduce our brand new Revit integration. With this integration, users are able to import and export in and out from Revit itself. This is a step closer to achieving a more seamless overall engineering design cycle. With this new integration, we even support the transference of sections, members, nodes, supports and loads itself. So what we've built here at SkySafe is a two-way information path, which means information about your SkySafe model can be transferred to a Revit model, and information about your Revit model can be transferred back into SkySafe. There are two ways of importing your Revit model into SkySafe. The first way is to do this locally. This can be done by downloading our free Revit plugin. To do this, go to our Getting Started page under our SkySafe documentation, Scroll down and download the dedicated installer. From there, open up the installer, allow any permission issues that should come your way, and you should be able to see that all the Revit files have been downloaded. From there, you can go ahead and open up Revit. Click load once or always load. Load in a Revit model of your choice. And from here, you should be able to see SkySiv underneath the add-ins panel on the Revit. To then export your current Revit model, all you have to do is go to View, go to 3D View to view your entire Revit model. Go to Add-ins, go to Settings, enter your username, API key, file name, and file path. Your file path is where this model will be sitting on the SkySiv file manager. And to get your API key, simply click Get API Key. That should bring you to your settings of your account. From there, just copy and paste your API key and your API username into the input box. Press Save. And you should be able to export your model right now. Let's take a closer look at the settings box. Launch SkySafe checkbox will automatically open up your default browser with the model loaded into SkySafe. Users also have the option to either include floors and walls of your Revit model. They also have the option to tick either to use continuous members for your columns and beams, include point or line loads from Revit, and also run auto repair model. Users also have the option to Change the tolerance for member connection, and this will dictate how the members are connected with one of another. And also, if they need more help, they can also click Need Help Getting Started link. Click Save, and click Export Model. And the model comes out on SkySafe together with your sections. And that's how you import your Revit model into SkySafe using the Revit plugin. So the second method to import your Revit model into SkySafe is through the cloud. We built this feature to allow users who may not have access to Revit but have a Revit file to import their Revit models into SkySafe itself. So you can do this by going to File, Import, Revit Model. Select the Revit model that you would like to import. And you should be able to view your Revit model in the web page itself. To then import this model in Discursive, simply click Import Model. And you should be able to see that model come through perfectly in Discursive. So, another feature we built in this integration is the ability to export your Discursive model back out into Revit. To do this, Go to File, Export, Revit Model. You should see your model being downloaded and just go into your Downloads folder, open the file in Revit, click View, View 3D, 
and you should be able to see your SkySim model that has been successfully imported into Revit. And that is how you import and export your Revit models in and out of SkySim.